What's up, Loopers? Matt McCoy here. I'm the founder of loopcommunity.com. And today I'm using our free app, Prime. It's the best and easiest way to run multi tracks in worship. It works for iPhone, iPad, and Mac, and it's a completely free app. So check it out. Today I'm going to show you, I'm using the Mac version, and I'm going to show you how if you if you want to actually just play with a click track instead of all of the multi tracks, you can actually add a custom click all within Prime. So I have a set list here of all my different multi tracks. But let's just say there's a song that we're doing that maybe we don't have a track for, but we just want to play to a click. Well, it's easy to do. All you have to do is click on Add Song and then go to Add Click Track. And now I can type in the name of my song. Let's just say it's Revelation Song. And the BPM is going to be, you know, 69. The time signature, I can choose that, you know, it'll be 4-4, uh, four, four. and then I can choose the click sound. I'm going to make that the digital click sound, it's my favorite. Let's hit create. And now I have a click within Prime that now my band can at least stay in time with that. Um, we can also change the tempo at any time here by just clicking the up and down arrow, and you can also change the time signature whenever you need to. If you need to change the click sound, just go into click settings and you can choose the click sound here. But that is dynamic clicks on Prime.